gratitude and appreciation, the first pillar of happiness, and its transformative power, gratitude and appreciation, are not just fleeting emotions. They are powerful practices that serve as the cornerstone of a fulfilling life. As outlined in my book, Decoding Human Nature, these virtues form the first pillar of happiness, influencing mental, emotional, and social well-being. Rooted in the highest human logic, native philosophies, and deep spirituality, gratitude provides a timeless roadmap for personal growth, resilience, and the pursuit of a meaningful existence. Why Gratitude Matters Happiness often feels elusive in a fast-paced world where achievements, possessions, and distractions dominate our focus. Gratitude shifts this narrative, anchoring us to the present moment and cultivating a mindset of abundance. By choosing to appreciate what we have rather than fixating on what we lack, we unlock deeper satisfaction and inner peace. In Decoding Human Nature, I describe how human logic, a series of behaviors, thoughts, and actions geared toward self-preservation and improvement, compels us to embrace gratitude. This practice encourages us to see our experiences, both positive and challenging, as opportunities for growth, connection, and enlightenment. Gratitude in this context becomes a transformative force that enables us to conquer our past, navigate adversity, and build a more harmonious life. The Ripple Effect of Gratitude Enhanced Well-Being Gratitude fosters resilience, reduces anxiety, and enhances emotional stability. By focusing on moments of positivity, we rewire our brains to counteract negative thought patterns, paving the way for greater happiness. Research supports this, showing that regular gratitude practice improves sleep quality, strengthens the immune system, and reduces stress. Strengthened relationships when we express gratitude toward others, we nurture trust and empathy. These expressions deepen connections and create a cycle of kindness and mutual support. Relationships thrive in environments where appreciation is openly shared, transforming not just individual lives, but entire communities. Resilience in adversity, as seen in the real-life inspired example of Sarah from my work, gratitude becomes a beacon during challenging times. By acknowledging small victories and the support of loved ones, Sarah cultivated emotional resilience, enabling her to face health challenges with grace. This illustrates how gratitude allows us to reframe hardships as opportunities for growth. The practice of gratitude. Gratitude is not a passive state. It is an active, intentional practice. Simple yet profound actions can bring its benefits to life. Gratitude journaling, reflecting on daily blessings, from the support of friends to the beauty of nature, builds a habit of appreciation. Expressing thanks, a heartfelt thank you to a colleague, friend, or family member, fosters stronger bonds and uplifts both giver and receiver. Mindful moments. Taking time to appreciate the present moment, whether it's a quiet cup of coffee or a vibrant sunset, cultivates mindfulness and presence. Why gratitude leads to happiness. Gratitude is the gateway to higher states of being. It allows us to conquer our past. By reframing past experiences, we move beyond emotional scars, finding meaning in challenges and strength in lessons learned. Cultivate contentment. Gratitude shifts our focus to what we have rather than what we lack fostering a sense of abundance and sufficiency. Enhance self-worth. By acknowledging our contributions and the kindness of others, we build confidence and self-esteem. In the broader framework of the Domenico model of hierarchy of needs from decoding human nature, gratitude helps us ascend through emotional evolution. It transforms stability into growth, change into enlightenment, and challenges into opportunities. Conclusion a universal practice with endless possibilities. Gratitude and appreciation are universal truths, cutting across cultures, philosophies, and spiritual practices. They remind us of our interconnectedness, our capacity for growth, and the beauty inherent in life's simplest moments. By embracing gratitude as a guiding principle, we not only enrich our own lives, 
but also create ripples of positivity that extend to others. As the first pillar of happiness, gratitude is both a starting point and an enduring practice. It is the lens through which we can view life with wonder, resilience, and hope, forging a path to fulfillment that transcends circumstance and touches the deepest aspects of our humanity. Let us cultivate gratitude, not just on Thanksgiving, but every day, as a profound and transformative force in the pursuit of happiness.